Hello viewers, welcome to the channel. I'm Tenerife Tess and I uh, do videos in and around the uh, touristy type areas in the south of Tenerife. If uh, that's your sort of thing and you like to see uh, videos of this, please carry on watching. Let's see where it takes us to. We are currently on the Maritime Walkway at Playa Las Americas, just behind uh, one or two of the hotels over there. Can you make them out? That is Las Palmeras. Have you stayed there at all, folk? Let me know if you have. Let me know your thoughts on that place. I've done a little bit of a walkthrough of there. You can check that out on the uh, playlist and have a look what they've got to offer there. Here we have like the Ippy type market. Not always open, it's a little bit hit and miss, but uh, have, a, uh, have a browse in there when it's open. I'm sure you'll find one or two trinkets and souvenirs and stuff uh, to take back home with you uh, when you've enjoyed your holiday over here. It doesn't look very nice now, but uh, believe me, when it's all uh, lit up and it's got all the goods in there, it looks totally different, it transforms it. Quite a few people walking around currently, although not many on the beach. Same as I say, it is a bit cloudy today, waiting for the sun to burn off the clouds and make it nice and bright blue. Little bit windy as well today. Ideal if you're a surfer, so uh, can't complain about that. Another bit of a mini market just there and more sports activities coming up on the right where you can play tennis, crazy golf and uh, one or two other uh, type of sports stroke entertainments. There you go folk, there's a quick look at that. One or two folk playing the football games and the uh, crazy golf and oh just a couple on the tennis courts over there. Maybe the weather's better for them because uh, it's a little bit cooler and the sun's not beating down on them. Do you play tennis? Would you play tennis on holiday? Is it your thing? Let me know what you think about that. Here's one or two more folk here, which you can make out. Let's have a quick look round. Yep, definitely playing the tennis just over there. More apartments just at the back and the Sol uh, Tenerife just approaching in front of us. We'll uh, be going past that in a little while so you'll be able to get a little bit better look of it. Have you stayed at the Sol Tenerife? Let me know. It is very very popular and very close to Veronica's so uh, ideal for the younger crowd although it is a uh, family hotel as well. It, um, something for everybody. There are two towers of it. The tower nearest Veronica's can be a little bit noisy into the early hours of the morning. So if you've got young families or uh, maybe are a light sleeper that tower is not the one to go for unless uh, you don't have a choice of course. Oh, the Koala Bay tucked away there. They're all over the island. And Marbahia which is another uh, trinket shop Oh, this, this looks nice folk, doesn't it? Cocktails on display as well. Restaurante Villaflor. So, uh, have you been here before? And uh, boots. The, the beer served in boots as well. How good is that? Perfume shop there as well. There are some more in board. Uh, perfume shops further up the uh, streets. Are they more expensive on here or uh, or not? Let me know on that. There are some on uh, the Golden Mile as well, although they do look upper market. Do prices vary much or are they all pretty much the same? That would be an interesting thing to, to know. The best place to shop for perfume if you're in that sort of a market. A sports shop just tucked away here, sports bar as well. And there you go, food advertised just on the board. You can just make that out. Paella. Nice place to be in these seats here, looking over to the beach. Stunning, isn't it? Have you stayed at any of these bars? 
or uh, activities there, water sports etc. If you continue up that road there it will take you up to the Traveller's Rest and Leonardo's. So it's a bit of a shortcut down to the playa. Bit better view of the Sol Tenerife there as well, a little bit of a uh, Giddies Park. So uh, some activities to do which uh, don't cost you anything. Maybe that's uh, good in this sort of age. The deep blue there, I believe they do nice stakes. Although you would think with it being deep blue, it would be a, more of a uh, fish restaurant. Possibly they do fish as well. I'll have to check that one out. Yeah, there's, there's the menus. And uh, if you stop in the sol, it does have access onto this uh, maritime walkway through the back gate. You can just make it out there at the pool and there is, uh, where the umbrellas are at the top, a solarium. The tower on the left is the noisier one, by the way, so uh, as I said before, possibly avoid that one if you are a light sleeper. Now, I do lots of videos all around the area, so uh, if it's your sort of thing, please think about uh, subscribing. It's absolutely free and it does not cost a penny. And it really helps out the channel. What do you think of the uh, Sol uh, Tenerife there? Oh, and there's the gate just cropping up here. So as you can see, easy access to the Maritime Walkway. Bit of a pool table just under the shade although it's not needed today, or certainly not at this particular time. Lots and lots of waves crashing up here today, folk. We'll uh, just take a look and a listen to those. A little bit rough today, so I suppose it's ideal weather for the surfers. Or is it ever too rough for the surfers? I don't know. Do they stop the surfers from uh, going in the sea if there's red flags? Well, let me know on that one but uh, the waves do vary up and down this coast so there are better areas for doing the surfing if that's your sort of thing. Not many up here, we are further down towards, um, heading towards Christianos down there, but definitely still in uh, Las Americas. It's a little bit murky today as well the sea, but um, every day is different, you can never judge it from day to day. What do you think? To nicely listen to the sea though. Yeah, definitely. But we'll continue on a little bit further. This is the Veronica's, just tucked away down here. And uh, as you can see from the sign, Macadies or McDonald's, you can go up there to it. And it's, it's not that far just at the other side of Veronica's. So uh, one or two handbags being sold here. You can tell from the wind with the trees going. Okay. And uh, oh, the waves look a little bit more uh, ferocious over here. This is a nice place to eat, give it a go. So uh, I would like to thank you for watching the videos. As I said before, it's much appreciated and I'll see you in the next one.